happening right now. We do have a verdict in the case of the two Tulsa women accused of beating a baby to death. Both face three charges, including child abuse murder. Our two news reporter Dan Perlman has been following the case. He's been in the courtroom. What can you tell us? Well, Karen, we just got a verdict just moments ago. I just came outside of the courthouse. Both Micah Schott and uh, Jasmine Williams were both found guilty of child abuse, murder, and child neglect. The jury recommended that they both serve life in prison without parole for this crime. Now, it happened back in March 2012. The two women were pulled over, and when they were pulled over, police found 19-month-old uh, Zamonte Green dead in the backseat of the car that the two women were in. They say that he had uh, broken ribs, uh uh, injured brain and a uh, injuries to his abdomen. Now, this has been a very emotional case. 26 witnesses were called to the stand over the last eight days. Today, jurors listened to four hours of closing arguments from both prosecutors and defense attorneys. At one point, the prosecutor said, quote, this case is about a baby who was literally tortured and beaten to death. Again, both Micah Schott and Jasmine Williams were found guilty of child abuse, murder and child neglect. The jury recommended that they serve life in prison without parole. They are scheduled to be sentenced in April. Live in downtown Tulsa, Dan Perlman, 2 News, works for you.